Hello, everyone. This is Ivan live stream here. I'm Danya. You know, last week I got a very terrible toothache, so I went to the hospital, and I noticed one thing that I think almost everyone has experienced but didn't pay attention. So today I would like to share that with you. Let's watch some videos. Yes, that's it. Blood collection. I think almost everyone has experience. But have you noticed the things they used for the whole procedure? Let's play it back. <laughs> Yes, there are two things will be used in this procedure. Blood collection tube and the needle. The tube is called vacuum blood collection tube. So, do you know how a tube is produced? I think you are also curious about this. So today, let's go to visit a vacuum blood collection tube factory. Hello everyone, so today we came to a vacuum blood collection tube factory. Let's go to the workshop and have a look. Follow me. Okay, now we are in the second change room. So uh, for entering into the clean room, we have to change our clothes and wear mask. Let's go. Okay, hello. Hi, so now we are in the clean room. We will go inside in different workshops to see how a tube is produced. So this room is for labeling. We can see. At the beginning, the tube without any label, label and now after this machine, 
the label will be pasted here. The tubes, empty tubes without labeling, are bought, purchased here like this as raw material. And here, after labeling, the tubes will be pasted the label like this. So just now we came out from the labeling room and now we are uh, in the hallway. In this workshop, they will feed the additives and put the cap and tube together and put the finished tube on a tray. and have a look. Is this the same with the tube you see in the hospital? Additives inside. For filling additives inside. And you can see there are different colors of caps. Uh, that means different kind of tubes. So for different kind of tubes, 
you will need to add a different additive. So that will be different stations. In this station, the we can see the cap will be put on the upside of the tube. Like this. After packing, the tube will be transferred to that station. It's for the vacuum station. All the tubes, after they will be after loaded in the tray, they will be packed like this by a film. And uh, there will be a label here, show the information of the tube and the procedure of blood collection. Okay, now our visit to a vacuum blood collection tube factory is almost finished. Do you have an idea to open your own factory like this? Next, I will tell you how. See you later. Wow, it's so cold, so I have to wear this jacket now. Okay, this time you uh, showed your interest to have your own factory of uh, vacuum blood collection tube. And I told you, I will tell you how. Then today, I will give you the reply how. Firstly, you need to have a factory. Secondly, you need to buy a production line. So today, I will invite you to Go to the most famous and the leading factory of vacuum blood collection tube production line in China. More than 85% uh, of Chinese factories are using their line. Among them, the most famous brands like Improve, 